All right, so welcome back to Sonk Frontiers. Um, yeah, since the la since the last session is finished, like um, the um, yeah the game got the second update, and um, yeah, it's uh, just birthday theme and all, all that going on. So I might as well like show that off. Also, I think there, there should be some changes here. Yes. Okay, so if I put that at zero. To like 20, that should be fine. And. Oh my god, okay. So yeah, they they <laughs> they changed quite a lot of things and it's uh make just make the overall like gameplay better. You God. Yeah, cause they uh, okay, I'm, gonna, I'm probably just gonna make the deceleration just zero completely. Yeah, they um, they also added the spin dash, which I I'm not gonna be doing in this playthrough because uh, you have to do quite a lot to get. You have to do like all the all these like new action chain challenges, and you have to S rank all them. And we're not gonna be doing that for uh, for this playthrough. But um, from what I've seen, it, it just completely breaks the game. <laughs> you just go crazy fast. You just uh, what is it? Um. <clears throat> Huge. Oh. Looks important. Yes, okay. Um Yeah, yeah. The, the spin dash just basically looks like super bust and you just kinda go around breaking the game with it. It looks really fun. Like I I, I, I would like to try it, but you do have to kinda go out of your way to get it, so um, and I I've been like putting off like finishing this game as it is so i just want to try and finish the main game on on camera and like do a lot of that other stuff on my own time and they added more they added a, like some more uh, music tracks as well i think you i think you can find more uh, throughout the world And yeah, they ju they just added a lot a lot of stuff to this game, and the fact that it's all free is insane to me. Like, this is a lot of content, but they added more. Oh, that feels so much better, dude! Like the the jump decelerated so hard, and like on the previous version, like man. Okay. But they added more Coco types as well, which are, um, whatchamacallit, they're, I, go, I gotta see how crazy, uh, the, uh, Super Boost or whatever it's called is. Um. But, like, yeah, dude. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. Whee. Wait, what is playing right now? Is that I I isn't that like a s theme from Free Riders? Huh. It's just like doing, going for a bunch of random songs. It's, that's interesting because like, that's not on the uh, um, 
the list of songs I have. Perception. Oh god. Yeah, that was good. But yeah, they added they added a lot more um, platforming challenges to the Coco, which is which is nice because it, yeah, if you remember from the last session, um, I said that like I I wish. That, that the game had more like long, like really long platforming sequences, and they, uh, yeah, they actually delivered on, on that, so that's actually pretty cool. I'll lower it a little bit for me. Oh, it's on the other side. I keep thinking it's on the uh, outer rail. Okay. Oh. I still feel like I barely understand the combat system in this game. Well, whatever. It's fine. I'm back here. But yeah, it's been... I mean, it hasn't been that long to be fair, but I... Uh, since the last session, but... I'm kind of at the point where I just want to get this game done, so... I don't know if I'll finish it today? I do, I do want to, I do want to, uh, like, give it a solid effort. I should probably actually go to where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, I'll give it a, so give it a solid effort to, uh, uh, finish it today. Oh, this is the, okay. Okay, you know what, at, at the, um, just for the sake that, I, just for the sake of, like, me wanting to finish it, I'm not going to do this right now, but, yeah, the, these are the action chain challenges I was talking about. You basically just do a bunch of stuff and get a good score. You, it's basically, uh, the, mm, I don't know. The easiest way I can describe it is basically like trying to get a good score and like, oh, like the, uh, I, I'm trying to actually get away from this in the Tony Hawk games or something. Like, you know, those, like some of the levels have like, uh, you go into like a, a tournament or something you need to get like the best score out of a bunch of uh participants um it, this kind of gives me similar vibes to that a little bit you know i i just i just wanted to uh get to the em emerald
he is... Why is he just, like, still moving after I stop moving the stick? What? So that is not something I want. Uh... Is it because of this? Yes. Okay, I think that's fine. Cool. Now for exploring the island and stuff. Yeah, it's, cra it's crazy how much the, the updates are, like, really making this game, like, just reach its full potential. I, I I think I'm at the point where I can safely say, like, yeah, this is not my favorite Sonic game by any means, but, like, it's definitely, it's on the right track, and the fact that, like, it's getting all these updates is really, really good. Like, this, if this is, like, what, uh, what this game is going to be like, like... Frontiers 2 is going to be, like, something special, I feel, like, it's, yeah, I, I'm looking forward to it. Um, that's fishing, I'm not going to bother with that. Oh. Kuno each. No! Yeah, that's how you do that. You have to, like... Yeah, that's something you get only from the uh, counters, I guess? Or parries? Uh... Where'd you go? <laughs> you just left. Oh. Lol. I need some more uh, port portal gears, so. Yeah. The other reason why. Um... Oh, nice. Palm Tree Panic. Cool. Uh, why can you not move left on the freaking thing? Yeah, I'll just have that play. I'll just do that and then, like, uh, leave it to, uh, play the other stuff. It's got her. Yeah, the, the other, the, the biggest reason why I just want to get this game done is that, you know, I, I want to kind of just move on. I mean, I've kind of talked about this before, but, yeah, i just taken so long to finish this game, and I want to get it done so I can move on to other things. Well, I've enjoyed my time with this playthrough, but um, I've completely uh, drained out conversation topics from this. Like, there's nothing. I, I really, I, I don't really have anything else I can say about the game. Uh, so I kind of just want to get it done. Uh, again, hopefully I can do it today, but you know, we'll see. It's also why I'm not bothering too much with, like... Uh, like D the DLC stuff, so I'm just, you know, I, I want to show you that it's a thing, but I uh, want to just, you know, finish the game and uh, probably do a bon like bonus episode or so uh, doing the, like, update free because that's probably, probably going to be pretty substantial. Like, what is it? People have already um, had, like, the... Some stuff from Update 3 has already been, like, leaked. Um, like, the uh, playable characters uh, apparently have, like, 
their uh, their own like full um, skill skill trees that have like the same amount of skills as Sonic does, which is insane because that would that would have to mean that they have like substantial gameplay for those characters, or you can just play the whole game as them. Like either way, like that's gonna be pretty gonna be a pretty huge update. Like and the fact that this is all free is insane to me. Like, just to think, like, a year ago, not a year ago, um, several years ago, this is the same <laughs> Sega that, like, um, charged Super Sonic in Forces. <laughs> so, you know, things definitely changed. I mean, they, well, not in the wind, nice. Uh, they, the Sonic Origins Plus is still a bit weird. Like, I feel like that can definitely, that could have definitely been free, free, uh, DLC. If it, like, if, if Frontiers gets, like, all this free stuff, which is arguably more gameplay than what Origi Origins Plus adds, then, like, why, why can't Origins Plus just be a free update? I don't know. I, I, it's just, things are weird. Origins is just a weird thing. I'm not really sure. I, I, I still haven't booted boot up Origins. Like, at all, like, I, I have the game, like, I've had the game for a while, but I just, I've just never booted it up, um, like, I, I don't know, stuff, or it's just, it's just a weird beast. Don't really have much else to say, say about it beyond that, I just, you know. I, th I do, I will say this though, I, I think it, on one hand it is nice that they, that they added like the, the um, master, uh, uh, what is it, the um, Game Gear stuff, but at the same time though, uh, well for starters, like what's the deal with that weird echo sound going on? And like the other thing is to like, why, why the Game Gear versions? Like, is your... Like, it, it, uh, I do like that they're making it so, like, these games are readily readily available again, but... Make make it so people can play the better, version, better versions of the game that have, like, no... They don't have screen crunch problems. Like, I... Like, if they did that, then yeah, this... I, I would... My, minor, like, problems aside, I, like... If they had like the master system versions of these games, then yeah, I I, I would say that this is the definitive like Sonic, um, like collection, especially since they have like all the challenge mode stuff and mirror mode and the cutscenes and all that good stuff. But the fact that it's like the Game Gear versions and it has that weird sound filter or whatever, like some weird echo effect, um, kind of hampers the experience. Like, I, I'm, I, I, like, I played Game Gear Sonic 2 before, like, year, like, years ago, obviously, so it's, I don't remember a lot about the game, but, you don't play that game, Gear, you don't play the Game Gear version of that game, unless you want to hate yourself, so, like, I, I'm not going to play that version, uh, of the game, like, I'm not going to play it on Sonic Origins, I'm going to find a emulated, like, ROM of the Master System version, because that's just the better version of the game <laughs> like uh, and i mean some some of the games they never had master system versions so like stuff like um what is it triple triple trouble i think uh fair enough like you don't have a, a master system version of that so game gear that's fine but like the for the games that do have one why not just use that version of the game for All Stars? Or All Stars, what am I talking about? What, use that version of the game for. Uh. Uh. Thing, what's it called? Sonic Origins! I'm losing myself right now, God. Uh. It's like. Yeah, I don't know. Origins is just so weird. I don't really get what they were thinking with it. Did I do this right? I feel like I messed this up. Maybe? Nah, 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 I feel like I should have done this earlier. 
was, yeah, that was, that was fought. I feel like I nearly got it though. Yeah, like, I, like most of the Game Gear versions of the game, of those games, the 8-bit Sonic games are fine, but again, like, better versions of those games exist, so like, why didn't you just port those, or like, emulate those versions? It's just so weird to me, I don't understand. Um, yellow, is it this first? I think that's correct. This should be correct. I'm really sure. Dang it, no! Oh my god, uh... Yeah, this is definitely the bottom. Oh, nice. Uh, okay, so... That. Yellow. Like. Um. Is correct, right? Yeah, and then Wait, do I do this one first? Wait, no, it's Ugh. this one first, and then the other one. I think. Oh. Okay. This is pro I feel like this is probably more of like the Tetris puzzle that people are probably struggling with struggling with. Because I am not Okay, so I did the blue first. Or did I do that before? Try this, I guess. Okay, cool. <laughs> Did it. Well, that was interesting. Get that like music note. Wherever it is. Um, I'm like, oh, it's over there. <laughs> That's it. City escape. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, so I guess the pl the plan now is just you know explore until we find the more cyberspace. And also, I don't understand the point of that. Like, what, what's the benefit of like having the Coco just show up where you are? Like, Okay. Cool. 
Oh, there's a barrier or the barrier there and everything. God. You know, considering like the this game went through a lot of um, development uh, testing, I guess. Like apparently they, they there was a lot of um, uh, trial and error to like make the open world work with Sonic in the way that people were happy with. Um, so now that they got into that point, I feel like with the next game, um, if it has like the, like a similar. De like dev time or what have you as this um i can see like them like i, I don't know i don't know if i i, I want to say like i feel like having five main worlds is like a good enough like um amount of game content uh, like i feel like if we if we like ask for like oh no we'll go like 10 islands or something or stupid like that like there's a point where it's a bit much but um I, I, I feel like, um, I feel like the next game, they could probably do with, like, maybe making the islands, uh, have more set pieces and more, and uh, have, have, make the islands have more, uh, I don't know, like, increase, increase the size and stuff, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> so I feel like, I feel like they can definitely do something like that and, like, make the uh, challenges more challenging. <laughs> um. Yeah, I'm definitely inter interested to see what they do. Especially, especially, especially since they, uh, Sonic Team have like hired a bunch of new employees, so that means that more people working on the games and more uh, manpower, so that's always a good thing, so. Maybe it won't take five years to get another game. <laughs> uh, or another mainline. Like, we're getting a new game, but... Oh, no, 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 I don't, I don't want to do this. Um. But we're getting a new game, but I mean, like, main 3D Sonic. Uh, I don't expect to get a new one until... Uh. Let's see, uh... Probably, let's see, it's 20, okay, it's 2023 now, this year is Superstars, uh, and I, what, I freaking, I to go away, um, I don't know if I expect anything next year besides Sonic Movie 3, uh, maybe, up, maybe DLC for Superstars and hopefully, <laughs> updates to Sonic Origins because god they, they, there's just like some little things that need to iron out uh, and then yeah I don't really expect a new game or anything next year, next year. Uh, I'm totally content with like the DLC for this game this year and, the, and then Superstars in like what is it like October um, yeah I, don't, I, I, I think we're I think we're fine I, I don't think we need a new uh, like something stuff like big next year i feel like that should just be i, I mean I, i'm not i'm never gonna say no to more content but uh i feel like next year is probably just gonna be movie free and like the, is the knuckle shoot i i don't remember the uh like th there's so much stuff happening with sonic lately like we have prime getting a continuation we have the knuckles tv show we have sonic movie free the frontiers dlc is like slowly like coming out I have Sonic Superstars now, and like Origins, Origins Plus came out, like, came out recently. Like, God, it's so much. Like, and the fact that like, not there, not long ago, we were starved for content, and like we're just having a, a f like a six-course meal. Like, it's kind of insane. Uh, yeah, I, I, I. I but yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if, like, next year is a little bit... It, we uh, end up having something a little bit more... Uh, what do you call it? Something a little bit more tame. But I, I don't expect next year to be 
flies crazy. Uh, like maybe I'm wrong. Maybe, like th this rumor, there were rumors of like a new Mario and Sonic Olympic game, which yeah, I can see that happening. Uh, I can I can definitely see that being like something that they might release next year or some or, or what have you. Um, like something like it's something that's like not as a uh, like big budget or well not not necessarily big budget uh, but like less uh, less of a big event because you know we've gone through that the Mar like the Mario Sonic game like stuff like several times we know what to expect and it's not that surprising anymore uh, like they're good games but yeah they don't really do anything to like surprise us that much um so i i, I would I, I i would like the uh, next game to do more dream like dream event stuff again because like like they haven't done really done much with that for quite a while and that was always at like, the best part of these games um oh nice finally found one And uh, Izuka talked about not um, doing a uh, SA2 remake and wants to, like, what, I forget what, what, what you said exactly, but um, there, were, there were like rumors of like SA1 and 2 getting remakes a while ago and doesn't seem like that's going to be the case, at least in the near future, which, yeah, I mean, Fine. I, I would still like like to see those games get remade eventually because of how like outdated they are. But you know, I think I think they I think those games are like fine. Like they they I don't think they necessarily need a remake. Like I, I don't think they're like what is it like uh, I I don't think they're like super broken. Well, I mean, some people would argue they they are broken, but I I would argue that they're mostly. Like, SA2 more so than SA1. Like, SA1 is pretty jank, but, like, SA2, I definitely feel like, is, a. Uh, it feels polished enough for the most part that I don't have much of an issue with it, like, playing it today. Uh, whereas, S SA1, I, I definitely feel like SA1 needs the remake treatment a lot more than SA2 does, because, yeah, SA1 has a lot of problems, and, like, you know, I, I definitely feel like a remake would help fix a lot of those issues um yeah i i just don't see like i, I don't i don't think I, I don't think like it's super necessary at the moment i feel like i feel like it like it, it's definitely i i definitely feel like it's a good idea to just focus on the uh the new stuff right now po like polish it up to make it this stuff as good as it can be and then you know, like, think about remaking the adventure games down the line. Or you can, like, outsource it to another studio, but... I'm not sure if I'd want that to happen. I, I don't know. I guess it depends. I'm definitely never gonna gonna say no to a adventure remake, but... I'm not clamoring for one either, if that makes sense. That was ridiculously close, by the way. <laughs> Damn. Cause yeah, yeah I, I'm, I'm, I'm not the biggest, I'm not the biggest fan of SA1, but I still, I still like the game for what it is. Uh, but I, I'm totally fine with those, with especially SA2 mainly. I'm, I'm totally fine with SA2's current state. So, I'm not really in a big rush for a remake of that game. Uh, so it's like, I'm totally fine with that. I, I, I kind of want to, I kind of just want to see the series move forward, like make new like like the new games and whatnot what have you because like stuff like frontiers and like what it could mean for the future of like 3d sonic and like and superstars like like um expanding on what expanding on what 2d sonic can be like yeah i i, I want to see more of this like this current stuff like and, and like yeah, i completely forgot about murder of sonic the hedgehog as well that, that's another just uh something else that like dropped um like since 
uh, like Frontiers came out, and it's like, so there's so much stuff now. <laughs> Again, we were, we were like in the the drought of the century after Forces, and it's like, because the thing is, like, it was pretty bad after Lost World as well, but at least with that, uh, like, say what you will about like Boom and all that, but uh, like at least that's that was at least we had that <laughs> as as, uh, as bad as those games were like we we had um the the boom games <laughs> for better or worse and uh we had the boom tv show like we had content after lost world but after forces there was just nothing <laughs> uh like what is it we had and then we had like the mo the the two movies like after a, after a while which you know that was something i, I guess like the there's like the comics and all that as well but you know, in terms of like the main game stuff, like there was just nothing. Like at least the booms, with the boom stuff, there were the uh, the boom, the boom games as bad as they were. But you know, it, it, there was there was some content. Uh, whereas like yeah, after forces, there was just what is it? There was like mania plus, I guess, and then there was just nothing. Like I. <laughs> It was hard being a Sonic Sonic fan during those years. Wait, like, like it's crazy how much things have changed. I'm still kind of at a loss for words. Like, not even well, not a loss for words, but like, I'm still kind of flabbergasted at how how much things have changed over these years. Like, such a short time frame. Um, See, so yeah, I. I I definitely wouldn't be surprised if we get more content next year, uh, beyond like beyond what we know. I mean, like, okay, is it Sonic Movie Three next year? Like, I don't remember if it's Knuckles, the Knuckles TV show this year or next year. So I'm pretty sure Sonic Movie Three is after the, is gonna be, is gonna happen like the year after the Knuckles show. Um, free speed, why not? Uh. But like, I don't, I don't remember. It might, this knuckle show might be this year. I, yeah, I'll, I'll post, I'll post like a message on screen if I, like, on screen, if I remember to do that in post. Yeah, boy. The shoe icon kind of looks like an acorn. <laughs> Found an emerald, but I can't access it. Nice. Whoop. Cool. <laughs> that's that's convenient. All right. Let's see if we can find any more uh, cyberspace portals while we're on the way there. Let's go this. Oh, music track. Alright, that, that's... Okay, hold on, hold on. I want to get this first. It doesn't matter. I assume that's SA1 version. Can I... You know what, let, let, let's keep... Let, let's just do it. See if we can do it while we... Uh, yes, sir. Okay, that was really easy. <laughs> do, 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 do. Right. Let's get the emerald. Whoa! Which, I, I guess one of one other reason I want to get this game done soon is that uh, Pikmin 4 is coming out, and I'm debating on whether or not I should do a blind playthrough of that. 
and uh, I re I'm really interested in that game, so I'd, I I I would like to uh, play that game. Like, I I don't know if, I don't know if I'll play it day one, but I definitely want to play it like soon after it comes out. So, it's just memory tokens. All right. Oh, right, 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 because that's the uh, tokens I've been collecting in this, on this island. Oh, I don't like, I don't like the silent things that just make things up, make dash pads appear and stuff. Bye. How you doing, buddy? Do you think you're gonna get me? I do love that they uh, brought, they managed to actually do the um, day and night cycle that they wanted to do since so six. Like, like you, you get beautiful scenery with the, like the change, the the uh, change of day, the the passage of passage of time. I guess. Uh, yeah. Like you wouldn't be able to get a lot of these cool shots if it was just stuck at day or night. Gonna be more. Uh, oh, here we go. Uh, Ikaruga. I think that's what it was. I think that's the um, shoe up that this is based off. <laughs> 